And TV, see outside the London Stadium. Um, West Ham nil, Zagreb won. Uh, ended the European campaign with a defeat, but it doesn't really matter, does it? No, no, at all. It was a, it was a friendly, to be honest. I, it's, I'll tell you what, it's nice as a West Ham fan. I've been following them for 20 years, and it's the least stress I've ever been about a, a game. It was, it, yeah, lost, strong or one, doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, we didn't need. We didn't need. Complete, anything. completely changed. Completely changed the lineup tonight. A um, lot of youngsters in there. Any of them stand out for you? Impressed you tonight? Uh, Alise, I thought it was impressive in Baptiste as well. Yeah, really impressed with him. Uh, yeah, it was. It was nice to. It was nice and moist to blood some of the youngsters mm. in because what an experience for them playing in European football. Yeah. That's a night they're never forgetting. I'm sure they're all going to keep their uh, shirts from tonight. They're not giving them away, are they? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I'd, like, I'd like to do a raffle for it, but <laughs> <laughs> that ain't going to happen. <laughs> but um, look, overall, I mean, we, we end the group stages now. We, we Obviously, we qualified with two games to go, won the group with a game to go. I mean, sum up the group stages. You've been impressed with us? It's been magnificent. Yeah, it's from uh, beating these lot in the first game, I remember Antonio finishing with a lovely goal. And then Declan Rice, it, was, it looked like bloody Prime Iniesta <laughs> in the Europa League. It was magnificent. And then, oh, who, cares? who cares how we ended it with a defeat? Who, who oh, wants to see cares? We're massive. We could, I feel we could take on the world. We could take on <laughs> Barcelona or Dortmund. Our fans are better than them. You yeah. see the, the yellow wall, not so mighty when the mighty Yammer's coming, let me tell you. It's nice that we can <laughs> mention our names with them uh, elite European clubs like Dortmund and Barcelona, but there's a long way to go now between now and, and March. We can sit back, we can enjoy the next round with our feet up and worry about who we're going to get. But we move on to the Premier League on Sunday. Burnley away, going to be difficult. Uh, devastating news this week about Kurt Zuma. I mean, what's your thoughts on that? Yeah, gutted for him. He was, he was such a rock. Uh, him and O'Bonner Fons. A brilliant partnership, the physicality that we needed. I hope um, Dawson and Diop can provide, uh, yeah, can provide the defensive solidity that we needed, and hopefully it doesn't affect the cohesion of the squad. And and if we can still keep our set piece, our set piece for it. I mean, I know Burnley are pretty good with Tarkowski and Ben Me and uh, but if the my if Thomas Selchuk or Antonio, if he can find, if he can get a goal again, that'd be magnificent. Yeah, we need him to start scoring. <laughs> but mate, listen, thank you so much for joining me today. Have a safe journey.